laughing at that. And I also made I place mask mask. because I was going crazy, right? It's all about the presentation. And kids can even help with that. You're just weaving the crepe paper on a plain white table. Bro, happy 4th of July to you. It's this 4th of July. Hello, no one is available to take your call. Please leave a message after the tone. Hi, Bubsy. I can't wait to see you. It's, um, it, gosh, it feels like I haven't seen you in so long. Um, but I can't wait to marry you and I can't wait to, um, walk down the aisle and see you and probably hear Louis squealing in the background. Um, and I'm just so excited and I love you very, very much. And, um, stop because I'm probably going to cry, but um, I, I love you millions and um, I can't wait to see you and I can't wait to be your wife and start our marriage adventure together. Um, okay, love you loads, bye! say how much I'm looking forward to the wedding next week. Uh, I know you've put so much effort into planning everything and uh, down to the, the final detail, but please, uh, please do make sure you start to relax because it's all gonna, it's all gonna come together, it's all gonna be perfect and you're gonna look beautiful. So uh, I'll see you soon, lots of love. So one day recently I was going for a walk, just me and Louie, and uh, I thought this is an opportunity for me to clear my head, to clear all my thoughts, figure out what I'm going to say. I quickly got a little bit jumbled in my thoughts, and, uh, and I was like, gosh, I'm just not really sure where I'm going to start. Do I start with how we, how we met, how we fell in love, is it our past, is it our future, or, you know, what is it? Is it the amazing uh, things about Heidi or qualities? I wasn't sure where to start. And so I looked down at Louis and he looked up at me and he, he gave me this look as if he was asking what was on my mind. And so I thought, oh, well, what the hell, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna talk to Louis and see what, see what he thinks. And so I said, well, daddy's gotta make a speech at, at his wedding. He's gotta say some nice, thing, nice things to, about your mommy. And uh, he's not quite sure where to start. And so he looked at me uh, in that way when kids are just sort of figuring things out. He looked at me for a moment and then he surprisingly and strangely said, well, well, dad, he said, uh, the ancient Greeks described love as the madness of the gods and modern psychologists describe love as the intense desire for an emotional union between two people. But what is love, he said. Before I could even answer or, or come to terms with the fact that he was talking to me, um, he said, what is love? And, and it's, it's interesting how it's so different for so many people. Different people, different kinds of love. It means different things to everybody. It's like, well, yeah, yeah, you might be right. Before I could say anything or respond, he said, well, songwriters describe love as when I'm near you, I hear a symphony. Shakespeare said love is blind and lovers cannot see. It's like, yeah, Louis, you're right. And then he said, well, love is a soul. Love is a soul combined in two bodies. And then he said, and the Indian poet said, the lane of love is narrow. It only has room for one. I thought, Louis, this is really fascinating. I don't know what mom's been reading to you late at night, but maybe it's all a little too philosophical for what I need to say to Heidi. And so he said, well, Dad, why don't you just tell me how you feel? How do you feel about my mom? And I said, okay, I can do that. And so I said, on a typical day, when I have to go to work, 
I wish I could stay. And when I come home, I wish I could travel faster. And, and when we're together, I wish time could stop. And no matter what we're doing or where we are, I feel like somehow when I'm with you, I'm at home. And we can be doing nothing and I can be happy. I love your laugh and your smile, your kindness and your thoughtfulness. And I looked down at Louie and he said, well, Dad, maybe that's what you should say.